Hey guys, what's up? So it is Monday, peak week number two. So today I've actually had pretty good energy, I guess still from the food I had Saturday. I really didn't eat too much. Um, I had one tuna sushi roll. Um, I had half of a cookie, one bite of carrot cake. And then on Sunday yesterday, I had some Delights ice cream, which is like a macro friendly ice cream. It's only three carb, two fat for a serving. Um, so this morning I woke up and my weight was the same as it was show day morning. So I'm in a really good position to be tighter this next coming show on Saturday. Um, so I'm pushing cardio. I actually did the incline 45 minutes faster today. And then I just did 45 minutes flat walking going to do the same tomorrow. So I'm doing a little bit more cardio than last week and then I'll taper it down. I had a really good leg workout today. Uh, my food is the same as last week. I'm doing like one, I'm, I'm only doing one rice cake uh, pre-workout and then no carbs the rest of the day, just protein. I was out of like my asparagus, so I didn't even have that today. Um, and yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm just going to keep depleting and then Friday I'll do some carbs. Uh, I'm not going to cut my water this week. I'm going to do a gallon every single day and we're just going to see what happens, but I'm still feeling pretty lean and about to get a salt bath and then just keep working. I'm just going to keep working. Hey guys. So it is freak. What day is it? Wednesday. It's Wednesday. Okay. Peak week number two, Wednesday. I am dying. You know, it's crazy is Sunday after the show, I had a lot of energy, you know, I was on this high from the show, I was so fired up. Um, I had a little bit of sushi Saturday night, and I was just feeling so good. I trained. And then Monday, I was still feeling pretty good. And I'm pretty sure it's because of all the energy from the show. And I had a really good leg day on Monday. And then yesterday, it was like it just hit me with a ton of bricks, you know. I'm depleting again. I Since Sunday, I've been back to my 800 calories. Um, if you're watching this and you don't compete, even if you do compete, this is not healthy. Don't do this. I wouldn't recommend it. So today is actually day 17 on 800 calories, and it is catching up with me. Saturday, the show day, I had 1,300 calories. I actually tracked what I ate, including the sushi. Um, so 1,300 calories, still not very much. But it's catching up with me, you guys. Like, I can't even hardly function. I'm just so run down. You know, and this morning was the lowest weight I have been since 2019 at Nationals. I was 110.8. I was 111.8 this morning, and this is the lowest weight I've been since then. My last shows in 2020, I was 114, so it's like... You know, I didn't think I would get under 115. You know, I have a breast augmentation now. I put on more muscle and damn, here I am at 111 pounds and I'm just withering away. But my legs are getting tighter. I mean, I want them leaner. I want my legs to be tighter. I want to freaking win, you know. I want to come up there on that stage and people be like, wow. You know, I've already wowed myself, but now I want to wow other people. So, um... I'm still pushing hard. It's like this morning, whenever I saw my legs, I was like, I want to keep going. I don't want to stop after this show because I keep getting better and better. But then just being in the gym right now, I'm like, I can't, you know, I, I got to think about my health and my body and, you know, it's going to end up being 20 days at 800 calories by this weekend. And that's just, that's too much. I mean, I know some competitors that do it, but a lot of them don't stay at that. They have refeeds and stuff. And the only really refeed I had, I guess, was last Saturday, 1,300 calories, which still wasn't really that much. Um, but this Sunday, I'm planning on eating. Nick and I are going out for breakfast and dinner, and, you know, I'm. it's going to be like a big refeed because I've been eating so low, and we haven't gone on any dates or celebrated or anything. Um, so I'm planning to do that. Uh, but I'm telling you, man, this is this is hard. This is very hard. I mean... I'm doing this week 90 minutes of cardio, hour and a half. Um, I've done, actually Sunday, I did two hours of cardio. 
Monday and yesterday I did an hour and a half with 45 minutes being incline treadmill. I did 45 minutes of incline this morning. Today's the last day I'm doing inclines Wednesday. I need to let my legs recover before the show. Um, but I'm going to do another 45 minutes flat walking tonight. Tomorrow I'll probably do an hour to an hour and 15 minutes of cardio all flat walking. And then Friday I want to hit 8,000 steps because last Friday I only got like 4,000 steps because I thought I need to rest, rest. And that, that my body doesn't like that. My body's used to moving. So this coming Friday, I'm just going to do flat walking, just steps, but I want to hit at least 8K steps. Um, and I'm drinking my full gallon of water, but I am going to cut it off after like 6 p.m. probably. Um, but I'm struggling. I was just sitting on the abductor machine, like sitting back, trying to like just recollect myself for a minute. And this old lady just comes and props up on the machine, staring at me, like waiting for me to get off there. And I didn't say nothing to her because honestly, I don't have the energy to talk to anyone right now. And then I get off, like I get myself off and like, whatever I had done four sets. So I get off of there. I go to grab the sprawl. She goes, don't worry. I got it. Just move. I'm like, listen, lady, like if you even knew what I was going through right now and how I'm feeling, maybe you'd be a little bit nicer to me, but whatever. So I just got out of there and now I'm about to head home and make my egg whites and head off to see patients. Lord help me. Tomorrow's going to be even rougher because I have a lot of patients tomorrow. I, this week was going so good. It was so much easier. I had less patients and then bam all of a sudden last night i resync my little tablet and all these patients come flooding in i hate that shit it's like where's the communication like can you ask me do you mind seeing these and i'm the type of person i never say no i never turn away work but if they add any more at this point i'm gonna just email and say no i'm sorry i cannot do anymore like tomorrow's gonna be a long day and i'm off friday Thank goodness. I'm off Friday, but you know, I'm going to go get my hair done. Um, I got check-ins, my tan, all that stuff and my shoulder. Oh my gosh, you guys, my insurance is not trying, is trying to not cover an MRI or for me to even see an orthopedic right now. So now I'm trying to see what it's going to cost for self-pay. I don't know why I pay for health insurance. Uh, the healthcare industry is, has gone to shit, you guys, and it's all because of insurance companies. This is why all my nursing friends and therapist friends are quitting. It's why I don't really want to be in therapy anymore. I don't want to work in the healthcare anymore. It's just, it's crazy. It's gotten ridiculous with the insurance. But yeah, so my insurance company, I was on the phone with them for an hour last night, basically begging them to authorize me to see an orthopedic doctor. And so now I'm trying to just get self-pay and see how much that's going to cost me. I don't even care at this point. My shoulder's been hurting so bad. Last night, it was literally on fire burning all night. So I wanted to keep going after the show. I got to take a break. I got to get this shoulder looked at. I've got to get my food up and start feeling good again. And then I'll get right back into prep uh, September 19th. Anyways, this is now six minutes long. You guys are going to get sick of listening to me and hearing this, but these are my thoughts. I haven't been on here much this week. I've just been low energy, but this is what's going on. Okay, I got all my protein prepped for the rest of peak week. Fish, chicken, ground chicken. This is pretty much all I'm eating. What's up? It is Thursday. I just got to the gym. I am coming on here because this week I have been pretty much non-existent on my YouTube videos. Um, I've just been really exhausted, tired, hungry. It's crazy. This week I'm so much more hungry than I was last week. And I'm eating the same low food, but I think it's just all catching up. But like all day long, I'm tying my shoes right now. <laughs> But like all day long, my stomach is just like growling and I'm just like with patience and it's kind of embarrassing and I'm just so hungry, um, but I'm making it, you know, it's actually a good thing because, you know, the more hungry you are, the more your metabolism is firing up and you're burning those calories. And so it's a good thing, but my workouts have been really crummy. Well, actually Sunday and Monday, I had a great workout, like the best workouts I've had in a few weeks. And then the last few days has just been really tough. I didn't sleep last night, probably like 
four hours, if that. I mean, I was awake all night. And then I just finally got up at 4.25. Um, so I'm about to go try and train. Today's just kind of like a pump up day, mostly. I'm just kind of doing like full body stuff. So I'm not too worried about having a lot of energy. Um, I'm just going to do a few lower body and upper body things. Nothing too crazy. I don't want my legs inflamed. Today, I stopped the incline and went to flat walking. What I did different than last week is last week I did flat walking all week. This week I did incline Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. So I made a few changes. Uh, tomorrow I'm drinking a full gallon of water. That'll be a change from last week. I'm keeping my food the same. Um, yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited, I'm leaner, I'm losing weight this week, and yep, it's going to be better, it's going to be better this week, so I'm going to go in here and do some training, oh, and my orthopedic surgeon just texted me and said he heard that my insurance wasn't accepted at his office, and he's going to call me as soon as he gets out of the gym and figure it out, he's like, don't worry, I got this taken care of, so there's hope for my shoulder. So I've got this big ass bag of salt, about to start another salt bath. Good morning, what's up? It is Friday. It is the day before show number two of the season for me. Um, so this week has been a little tough. I've been hungry, very, very hungry. Um, you know, I've been tired. I've been tired for weeks, so I'm not really going to complain about that. But yeah, I mean, I'm feeling good. This is the leanest I've ever been. I dropped a pound this week and uh, I just look a lot tighter. I look a lot tighter. Am I shooting for two pounds? I really think tomorrow morning I wake up, I'll be down more weight. Um, I can just feel it. But anyways, so I changed completely what my plan was for today going into the show. Based upon what I look like this morning, I look incredible, the best I've ever looked. I don't wanna mess this up. Last week I cut water to 50 ounces and cut it out at I think like 435. I had 58 grams of carbs and I've been eating no carbs except one rice cake. Uh, so since I look so good this morning, I don't want to mess this up. So I've decided that today I'm not changing a dang thing. I am not changing. I'm even going to take my greens. Last Friday I didn't. I won't take them tomorrow on show morning, but I'm about to drink my greens. Um, I'm going to eat all my same meals, except I am going to take out my very last meal. So I'm going to be cutting a little protein out. Uh, I'm not going to have any carbs except for my one rice cake. I'm gonna drink a gallon of water, which I'm gonna have that done by 6, 7 p.m. is my goal. Um, but I'm not gonna change anything, really. I'm not changing nothing. I'm, I'm taking out my last meal of egg whites, that's it. And uh, I'm doing 45 minutes of fasted cardio flat walking. Last week I only did 30. And last week I only hit like 4,000 steps on the Friday. I was resting, resting. My body's not used to that, so I'm gonna be active today. I'm gonna go to the gym, I'm gonna do, um, some posing and maybe a little light pump up just super light body weight stuff and then i'm gonna go walk around you know go to a couple stores and walk around and get some steps and my goal today is to hit at least eight thousand steps maybe ten um and i know this probably sounds crazy to people you know but sometimes you don't need to make changes sometimes you don't need to manipulate things sometimes you need to just keep going with the flow i'm not doing incline i'm not doing stairs i'm not doing crazy cardio i'm not going to do a crazy workout um but i'm not going to carb up and tomorrow before the show i probably will carb do some carbs i will actually before prejudging i'll do some carbs but i'm not going to carb up today i'm i'm just going to roll with the flow of what i've been doing and just roll right into the show day, doing exactly what I've done this whole week because every day this week I've looked better and better. And I, if it's not broke, don't fix it. You know, if you're if you're looking better each day, there's no reason to make all these drastic changes. And last week, I think that hurt me, you know, making all these changes, trying to get ready for a show day. And uh, so that's my plan. I'm excited for it. So get this, I got some cookie orders. So I had to make cookies yesterday. I'm going to ship them out. These are the PB. It's kind of hard to see. Um, but it's like a chocolate cookie with uh, Reese's Pieces, Reese's Cups. So good. And then 
how to make my favorite cookie of all time, the velvet. It's a red velvet cookie with uh, Oreos and white chocolate chips. This is my all time favorite cookie. My favorite cookie in the world. Hands down, I've tried a million cookies at all places. This is my favorite. And I had to make them last night. So whoever ordered these cookies, just know that they were made with love because I didn't make any cookie orders last week on peak week and I decided yesterday, you know what? I'm just gonna get it done. And uh, my mind's strong, you know? I haven't cheated on my diet at all this entire 18 weeks. And I, I don't want to, you know, last week, even coming out of the show, I, I did really well. I did not have a rebound. I didn't eat any junk, really. I had half a cookie on show day, actually before finals. And then after finals, I had a sushi roll and then I had Delights ice cream, which I tracked on Sunday. Um, and uh, yeah, that's it. But this Sunday, I am going out to breakfast and dinner with Nick and I'm excited for it. I'm gonna have, I'm going to actually have some real food. Okay, I'm going to go do my last cardio session. So, I am literally freezing cold right now. I've been cold all morning, so I'm just like about to do some work. I'm drinking a tea and I'm just chilling for a few minutes. I have to leave here and like... 20 minutes to go see the orthopedic surgeon finally oh my gosh he texted me he's gonna see me um today and then he's gonna write an order for an mri so next week i get an mri um but yeah i'm doing client check-ins i gotta go see my surgeon i'm gonna come back wash my hair it really doesn't need to be washed yet but i want to wash it and then um i've got everything packed up i decided to stay at the hotel I was going to stay home, but I just, I need to be there. I need to be there and be close to everything. So I booked the hotel. Um, I just got everything packed. I got my food all prepped and in individual bags for what I'm going to eat tomorrow. I already have it all tracked in my fitness pal and ready to go. And I'm just kind of chilling, doing client check-ins while I wait to go see my surgeon. And then I'll come back get a shower and then I have my hair appointment at four. I'm doing curly hair this week. So I'll get my hair curled and then I'm gonna hit the road to Orlando. So I did do a workout this morning, shoulders, um, just real lightweight. Last Friday I didn't work out and I did less cardio. And so today I'm just, I'm trying to kind of stick to what I normally do because I looked really good yesterday. I looked good this morning. I don't wanna mess it up. So, um. Let's see where I'm at right now. Hold on a second. Yeah, I'm at 7,000 steps already. Last Friday, I only did 4,000 total for the whole day. So my goal was to get eight to 10,000 today, which I'll hit. Um, and yeah, I mean, I did a little shoulder pump up. I did some posing practice. I'm really proud of my posing. It looked really good in the gym this morning. And... Um, I'm feeling good. You know, it's weird. I feel different this week than last week. I feel like I'm not as excited for some reason, even though I look better, but I don't know. I'm just, I don't know. I, today's kind of weird. I don't know why I'm feeling like this, but uh, I know once I get there and everything, it'll be good. Okay, so I finally saw my orthopedic surgeon friend from the gym. And they did an x-ray and nothing shows on the x-ray. So um, he did a full exam and I failed the impingement test and another uh, dropped arm test. So he is going to order, he ordered the MRI. I should have it next week. And then I am going to see him next Thursday to go over the results. I can't wait. He said he thinks it's torn. Um, if it is torn, you know, we'll see what degree of the tear is, but he said it'll probably treat it with a steroid shot unless it's torn bad enough to have to have surgery. Um, hoping I don't have to have surgery. Oh my gosh. After the two surgeries I went through last year and not being able to train my shoulder. Oh gosh. But, um, so we'll see. So next week's going to be a exciting week to figure this shoulder out. Okay. So I'm headed to get my hair done now. I'm having it curled for this show. I just washed and blow, blow dry it. Blow 
blow dried blow dried my hair myself wow i can't even talk but uh yeah i'm headed to my girl my hair girl she's gonna curl my hair up and then i'm hitting the road to orlando let's go okay so this is my show day curls she made them a little bit tighter so when i sleep on it tonight it'll kind of get looser so it'll look more like uh beachy lucy waves um tomorrow morning so i'm excited i love having my hair curly so tomorrow will be a new look let's go okay so we just made it to the hotel in orlando um i'm about to change real quick and then head down to check-ins and then i have my tan and we will be ready to go i'll keep you guys posted on what number i am okay so i'm number 90 tomorrow i'm gonna be in class c this is a smaller show so i think there's only four yeah there's only four classes um but yep number 90 i'm going to get tanned right now <laughs> there she is. I'm all tanned up. Got my fish here at the microwave. 